Hi, my name is Al Nar. I was a Navy corpsman with the Marines in Vietnam, and I worked at a medical battalion in surgery. And I can tell you from being in the military, being deployed in a combat zone, um, there are very few things that can bring you comfort. We didn't have access to a PX or any items like hygiene items, any food products aside from our regular mess hall. We had nothing. So I'm here in the facility where they do all the packing. As you can see, all of these bins contain various items that are of need to our forces. But some of these bins are empty. And that's why we need for you to please help us support our troops and support Forgotten Soldiers Outreach. It's very important. Each one of these packages costs about $30 to send out to our troops. Please, please support Forgotten Soldiers Outreach. Don't forget that every dollar that you donate goes into uh, supplying our troops and bringing home to them when they're far from home. I remember getting packages and I remember when there were no packages for me. And that was a, a, a sad time However, when we learned about Forgotten Soldiers Outreach and what they do for our men and women in uniform, we immediately got on board because they do a, an amazing thing for our troops today and we can't forget them. They're serving to protect us and we have to support that. Imagine somebody stationed today receiving a package like this. This brings so much comfort and joy that you can't measure it at all. And I've been there, I know what it's like, I know what they go through. Please um, support Forgotten Soldiers Outreach. Imagine if you were in another country and you were in harm's way and mail call and you get nothing and other guys get something, Forgotten Soldiers Outreach makes sure that everyone gets something. And that's important for us to realize that, and it's important for us to support that. So please make a donation today. Please be generous. Think of those who are less fortunate that are out there protecting us. Without them, we're in big trouble. What's going on around the world now, um, there's more focus on our troops and on our country than ever before during my lifetime. These are very, very dangerous times. And a lot of people who don't have the military experience or don't have a family member in the military, uh, sometimes they say, well, doesn't affect me. I'm here, you know. I can go to 7-Eleven or Publix and do whatever I want, get whatever I want whenever I want to. They're not thinking about the guy who's on a DMZ somewhere in uh, South Korea or, you know, in Europe deployed to the lines of Europe with what's going on now with Russia. They're not thinking about him and her. They don't their lives don't revolve around that. And that's why we have to have more awareness and how important our military is. When 9-11 happened, and that was a result of um, probably equivalent to Pearl Harbor during our lifetime, um, there were so many Americans who went and signed up, who went into Desert Shield, which turned into Desert Storm. And that hit a nerve here because that's when Forgotten Soldiers Outreach was uh, formed and turned into what it is today because of that one incident and been going strong for the last 26 years because people who do understand about military, who do understand 
what a sacrifice our men and women are making, um, those people will continue to support our effort, what we're trying to do here. And the only way that people who don't really understand the importance of that is to pass the word and, and by doing these kinds of things, I think we grow. If you have someone in your family who's serving in the military, or you know someone who's serving in the military, or if you've served in the military, it's important to keep supporting our troops. And the way you'll support our troops is to support Forgotten Soldiers Outreach. Please give today. Every dollar helps. Thank you.